Hey friends, today we're just gonna have a little bit of fun with a guided drawing where I'll show you step-by-step step what to do. And this one, we're gonna have a Valentine's Day Grogu or Baby Yoda. So you're gonna need a pencil to start with a piece of paper and then any coloring supplies you want. Miss Hoffman's gonna use a Sharpie just so you can see my lines, but you know, if I mess up with a Sharpie, I just mess up. So make sure that you're doing it with a pencil. We're gonna start by drawing a wide rainbow arch shape. Like this, okay? Remember if I go too fast, just to pause me. Next, we're gonna go out this way. And we want it to be symmetrical, which means same on both sides. And then we're gonna go out this way. Okay, those are gonna be his ears. All right, next we're gonna curve in a little. Curve in a little, okay? Then we're gonna go out a little, back to the head. Out a little, back to the head, okay? Now we're gonna do the inside part of his ear. We're going to go start about right here, curve up and go all the way across here. Start about right here, curve up and go all the way across about right here. Next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna bring his face down a little bit more, down a little bit more. And then we're gonna make his clothes kind of coming up over his neck and face just a little bit. Kind of has like on a Jedi cloak. So we're gonna go cross all the way. Poof it out just a little bit for the collar on his cloak on each side, like that. And then we're gonna connect like this. And maybe a little line right here where the two meet. Next, we're going to bring his upper body down a little bit. So you can see this arm right here. His upper body down a little bit, but this arm's gonna be putting up. He's gonna be using the force to make some hearts for Valentine's Day. And if you're making this not at Valentine's Day, that's okay, you can have him creating anything you want. Maybe he's creating some slices of pizza or he really likes frogs, you can have him creating a frog. So we're gonna go up, down at an angle, over, down at an angle, rewind if I'm going too fast, this is just making his sleeve, and then back down. So let me kind of go over those steps again. I went across. Okay, down, down, that's one arm. It's gonna be kind of setting in his carrier, in his like baby carriage. Then it's gonna go up at an angle, up at an angle, down at a slight angle, over, down, connect. Now we're gonna make his hand. It's gonna go up, down, up, down, like that. Kind of go up down, and then we're gonna make his thumb come up right about here. All right? So I went up, down, up, down, up, down, kind of like three bumps, and then just come up, kind of a little thumb sticking up right there. Then we're gonna start making his carrier. We're gonna go all the way across, like this. Make a skinny little line all the way across, like that. Then we're gonna make a wider line going all the way across. And then his carrier is kind of like a circle. We're gonna go down, whoop, mark on my girl's table. Down, like that. He's got some buttons on the front of his carrier, so we're gonna draw three buttons. Okay, then we're gonna do an oval or circle on this side for where it closes. Like that. 
oval or circle on this side, kind of behind his hand, like that. And then we're gonna make it kind of look like it's going behind him. So it's kind of like a big rainbow arch. That was off a little bit. There we go. Big rainbow arch behind him that's gonna come back down to this connector. Another one. So it's like in his little electronic baby carrier that Mando always has with him. Next, we're going to do a rainbow arch for this eye and a rainbow arch for this eye. Line across, line across. I let it extend a little bit on each side so it looks like a wrinkle in the skin right here. You might not want to do this part with a black marker because it looks too harsh, but with your pencil, you can really lightly do the little creases in his skin right here. Little rainbow arch for his nose. And then we're going to give him a little half smile. We want to leave some light reflections in his eyes. So I'm going to draw a couple of circles for light reflections. And then when you start to color this in, you will go ahead and color the rest of his eye black. I'm gonna shade that in so you can get a look of what it's gonna look like. Okay, next we want him to be using the force to create some hearts. So we're gonna have him do hearts coming out. From his hand. Just as many as you think it would look good. Isn't that cute? Cute, and if you're doing this anytime besides Valentine's Day, you can have anything coming out of his hand that you want. I hope you enjoyed this drawing. I'd love to see it if you made it. Bye, guys.